Fritz Isaac Dirkse, one of the Nama language experts, seconded to South Africa, says the project which started in 2016 has been a success, as some of the participating teachers and community members were recently admitted to study Kwekokopap at UNAM Southern campus. The South African government, according to Dirkse, aims to develop the Nama language, after which the language will be considered as the 12th official language in that country. By its constitutional provisions, it, it, it depends South African Language Board. The uh, National Language Board has been mandated to undertake this uh, project of developing the Nama language. And subsequently, I was drawn in by the uh, South African coordinator for the training agreement, Master James Mabanga, to assist them with uh, the, a pilot project because they had to implement it at two schools, Kubus and uh, Nkankais. Dirksa says the development of the Nama language in South Africa will equally enable Namibian authors to have a larger market for their publications. Large number of people are speaking this side of the border, the language, but on the other side, it's a very few people. But in terms of the population totals, the Nama people on the other side are higher, uh, but lost their language. So in South Africa, there are about 3.4 million people that claims they are from Nama descent. So imagine once this language can be developed in South Africa, uh, what a market it will be for the for the authors and for the language in general. It will be a very positive development. The Directorate of Education, Arts and Culture in the Karas region, in collaboration with the Department of Education in the Northern Cape Province, continues with the development of a Nama language curriculum in South Africa and the subsequent production of teaching and learning materials. Na Tangwajimi NBC News, Kiat Mansuwak.